Hey guys, my name is Evan. Today I'll be unboxing Union Achilles A5. Oh my gosh, guys. We have the brand new Beyblade Burst Rise Hypersphere Union Achilles A5. And I am so, so excited when... Um, I watched a YouTube video about this guy. I was saying like, oh my god, I need to get him. And I just watched Zanky's video this morning. And I was like, oh my god, it has the changing modes. I was like so excited. And uh, yeah, so I have one right here from Target. And uh, yeah, we're just going to get straight to the unboxing. But before we get to that, uh, it comes with D77, TH12, or... Um, you need the parts right here, and it comes with your standard rise launcher, and it has four for drop-in time, I think, and two for run time. And yeah, it is a balance type, right, spinning, and uh, yeah, I'm just so excited, so we'll tear this open. I don't think I did any damage, but uh, yeah, we'll tear this thing open right away. There we go, we got the instructions and ripcord. And uh, yeah, here's the bay. Here we have the ripcord. Uh, rip that out. Instructions. And uh, yeah, I'll cut out all the parts. So we have your standard uh, rise launcher here, which can spin left or right. And sorry guys if it sounds like I'm rushing, because I am, I am rushing. <laughs> I'm really excited to open this. And, uh, yeah, so we'll open this, too. And I don't know why this is not cutting. And, uh, yeah, okay. There we go. And, yeah, we'll take off the layer. We'll, uh, clear this of, uh, lots of trash. And, uh, yeah, let's get straight to the review we have. Um, start from bottom up. We'll start off with this, the hypersphere driver. And, uh, yeah, it looks pretty cool. It's like Extend Plus. <laughs> Not very sure. I think it is. So Extend Plus Hypersphere would be. So, yeah. Uh, of course, it doesn't have the actual gimmick. It is a Hypersphere driver. But, uh, yeah, I guess it looks kind of like it. And then we have uh, this disc. I forgot what it's called. Like Control or something. But, uh, yeah, this is a hype, uh, Hypersphere or a Hasbro exclusive disc because the Takara Tony one actually has a working gimmick and stuff. But, oh, well, it's just a giant oval. But what we may, what I'm mainly here to see is the layer, which is Union Achilles. And so, yeah, we have the chip here, which is Achilles. And, uh, yeah, you can scan that code. Hopefully you'll be able to scan that code. And yeah, there it is. And it also has the Power Blades. And uh, yeah, this is the Union Achilles Power Blades, which you can remove from the base. So yeah, here's what it would look like without them. And as you can see, when you put the Power Blades on, it um, adds this blue part. And it actually puts like a weight design there as well. So yeah, we'll take a look at the... Layer first without the power blade, so it has some swords. And uh wait a minute. Oh yeah, this is this is painted. Okay. It would actually be better if this was um just another mold because that paint could possibly chip. Well, I it probably is gonna chip a little. But uh yeah, so we have the power blades and uh put them on. Yeah, there we go. And to lock them in, you have to put in your chip. Uh, they can just, like, fall out on their own without it. But I guess it's not falling out. But, like, it's not, like, a click or anything that keeps them in. They just slide in the place. Now, here's what it looks like with the power blades. And, uh, yeah, we can insert our chip to the top. And, uh, yeah, we'll assemble the bay. And, uh, yeah, this is you. Oh, my God. That's pretty tight. Yeah, that is pretty tight. And if you want to see the slopes, there they are. And uh, yeah, that that's pretty tight. That's that's gonna be pretty good, I guess. 
See here it is. Very, very nice. And uh, yeah, so next we'll get to some test bins and test battles. Hey guys, I'm here with Union Achilles. And uh, yeah, I have the standard orange Hypersphere Stadium to do a test spin. And yeah, first we'll be putting him in power mode. So yeah, three, two, one, let's go. There we go, that's Union Achilles in power mode. Very nice. And uh, yeah, now we'll do a um, test in speed mode as well. And uh, yeah, so I have now taken off the power blaze. And yeah, we'll do a test with speed mode. Three, two, one, go. And uh, yeah, I found it was actually a lot more harder to do it to um, um, put him on the launcher in speed mode because as you can see, it's like really hollow on the sides. So uh, the launcher prongs don't really have anything to rub against or like kind of guide them into the slot that they need to be in. So uh, yeah, next we'll do some test battles. First we'll go Sword Valtriac. And uh, yeah, we'll be keeping Achilles in speed mode. There we go. Ooh, and a clean burst from Achilles and uh, yeah. So that was in speed mode. Next we'll try Bushin Ashindra. And uh, yeah, we'll be keeping Achilles in his speed mode. So uh, yeah, here we go. Sorry about this. But um, it is hard to put Achilles on the launcher like I said. So yeah, I did have a little bit of a difficulty putting him on. And of course he wins because he was launched second, I guess. But uh, yeah, we'll try that once again. Hopefully he'll stick on the launcher. that Achilles so he flew into the air and let's see the winner is Achilles and uh, let me see for a second okay so yeah uh, we'll do the same battles in power mode. okay now starting off yet again with sword Valtric and yeah now we'll be having Achilles in power mode. Hits by Valtriac, and the winner is, um, I almost said Turbo Union, Achilles. And yeah, we'll have one more battle. And uh, yeah, there we go. And yeah, the winner yet again is Achilles. Next, we'll try Bushin Ashindra. Wins. We'll try it one more time. So. Achilles actually seems like he'd have more run time than drop in time. Yeah, because a lot of these finishes are um, are a lot of survivor finishes or spin finishes. And uh, so, yeah, so those were the test spins with Union Achilles Hasbro. So, yeah, now back to the studio. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.